Hello and welcome to my unboxing and first look at the Warlord Titan Arioch or Arioch Power Claw. It's right here in this box. It will set you back £103. Super Saiyan, £103 for one weapon option. Yes, but this is for one of the biggest and the most expensive model that Forge World currently produce at the start of 2021. And it has been for the past six years. Let's unbox this and have a look at the power claw. We call it fists as well. You know, get the fist, I'll buy a fist, I'll equip my warlord with fists. There's no real uh, benefit of equipping your warlord with two fists other than it looks really really cool so we unbox this and right here we have a couple of boxes we have the fist or the power claw in this box so we have the uh, battle titan melter cannon so that's for the reaver I'll unbox that in a separate video, of course. And then we've got the Arioch or Arioch uh, Power Claw. I'm just going to call it the Arioch. Uh, but uh, there we go. There we go. You get it in this beastie box. Um, I think it's got some uh, instructions of how to build it. At least I hope it has. Oh dear. Cut my nails today, so yep, fail. <laughs> and wow. So this is the most expensive. Uh, uh, weapon uh, for a warlord right now and um, this is the instruction guide it says here the mars pattern warlord titan arioc power claw i think i might have it in the left hand i'm not sure but uh, they're the number of parts you've got an elbow pivot um, you've got a wrist wrist armor vulcan mega bolter hand hand armor finger bases middle fingers fingertips and claw tips as well as well as finger pistons um, ammo doors for the uh, mega bolter 2 and uh, there you go that's how you put it on um, so you've got the mid thumb and capacitators capacitors and so on and the claw tips so you can either have the um, yeah the fingertip can be replaced with the optional claw tip definitely gonna have claws with mine it just looks awesome um, gives it a bit more reach as well, but uh, there you go. That's how you put it on. So that's the instruction guide. Uh, let's have a look at the parts. I always ha like to have a look at these. Uh, they're in the new bag. Fantastic. And actually, what they've done is they've they bundled in this how to work with resin and the check by uh, leaflet in with with them. So this was uh, checked by KR on the twenty second of February. I'm unboxing this on the 26th, so it's only four days old, or four days young. Amazing, um, very, very fresh, right out of the mold. Oh, look at this. Two pieces in this bag. They look fantastic. Oh, can you see that? That is beautiful. Really, really is beautiful. Oh, look at all the detail. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. That's almost as big as my hand look. Nice to meet you. <laughs> and then this is the uh, Vulcan Mega Bolter um, top. Oh, again, that looks beautiful. Not really very slimy at all. Um, these out of, the, out of the box. Look at the detail in there. Amazing. Lovely kit. It's optional. You don't have to put the Vulcan Mega Bolter on, but I will because it looks so damn cool um, so they're the two pieces in the new bag let's have a look at uh, these pieces wow huge number of pieces in this bag so there's the uh, attachment um, I think it goes that way uh, there's a plug and socket um, system going on and so that means I'm gonna have to drill in through there and I might drill in through there first uh, before I um, attach it all together because otherwise it's going to be pretty difficult to put it in the old vise and then drill through this but we'll we'll see here are some of the claw tips oh lovely amount of detail on these look at the uh, rivets oh beautiful
beautiful. I was wondering whether there's going to be some slippage on there, but there isn't. Um, here's part of the armour plate there. Uh, some of the fingers. More fingers and the Vulcan Mega Bolter barrels. I've had some issues with these on the old uh, Warhound before, but they look fantastic. More fingers. These, uh, this capacitor. That looks lovely, the amount of detail on there. If you can see that with the rivets. That's amazing. Uh, another armor plate. Now another one. And this wrist attachment. Uh, I've got some pistons, finger pistons, and uh, the claw tips again. Along with another armor plate. And I think that's the thumb. Along with more fingers, and you've got some cabling. And here's some finger tips. If you don't want to use the claws and some more fingers and another attachment and another finger as well so yeah this is uh, fantastic I'm really liking the look of this uh, it's, it's so big as well yeah this big big fist it's incredible um, so yeah Wow, uh, you get a huge number of parts. This is a fantastic um, kit to uh, to put together, or will be. Um, yes, it's it's not as kind of large or as intimidating as as the big, big, um, you know, Bellicosa or Volcano Cannons or even the Gatling Blaster or the uh, Plasma Annihilator, but um, certainly has the most parts in, in all of these uh, big weapons. So what I'll do is I'll uh, go away and uh, build this and uh, get you a review and show you it how I've magnetized it and attached it to my to one of my World War Titans so I uh, hope you join me for the review what do you think of the first impressions of this fist please do uh, put your thoughts and opinions down in the comments below It'd be great to hear from you thank you ever so much for joining me today thank you for watching the Emperor Protects <laughs>